Hi there, it's Pete. Welcome to lesson number six, series two of the Easy Beginners Baritone Ukulele. We'll have a little look at what we've done over the last five um, lessons in a sec, and we'll have a look at this uh, this new lesson number six. It's uh, Broken Arrow by Noel Gallagher's High Flying Birds. Absolutely brilliant tune. Um, it's got six lovely chords there. So um, we'll have a little look at our five lessons and this one, and have a little recap. But what I've done last weekend, we uh, we went on a camping holiday for the weekend, and I took my baritone ukulele with me. Um, I'm always taking an instrument with me anyway, just bung it in the car, and um, if it's raining, wrap it in a black bag in, in the back of the trailer. So, uh, but um, yeah, so I took my baritone ukulele and some music, some some books and things, so I could have a look at, and I've actually got together another six lessons so i'm going to do a series three for the easy beginners baritone ukulele so it's going to be like a mixture of um, artists first um, band i'm going to do is a rolling stone song um, which they play acoustically uh, sounds absolutely fantastic but i won't tell you what it is um, i'll let you have a guess when i'm playing and um yeah so it's going to be another little six lessons for the easy beginners baritone ukulele um, I've had a few people ask me that um, I am actually strumming it like a guitar. Uh, why not? So, um, so actually, I suppose I do actually play it like a a um, guitar, but that's the way I do it, and I think it sounds nice, nice and bassy, and right. So, and also, if you want to play any of the tutorials for the baritone ukulele on your guitar. Um, it will come easy because I've taken all my um, tutorials for the baritone ukulele from my guitar sort of tutorials. Um, I've changed a few little chords around, but um, yeah, you're welcome to uh, do it on your guitar if you want to. Um, yeah, right, so the last five lessons we've done, we've done lesson number one, we've done Wonderwall. Um, that was a great tune, Oasis tune. So that's an E minor, G, D, A7 with that little abridged chord in between a G, F sharp and an E minor. Uh, lesson number two, we've done one of my favorite tunes, Slide Away. Um, e minor, D, C, A7, A minor, A sus2. So that's Slide Away, lesson number two. Lesson number three, this is my ultimate, I know I've got two or three ultimate sort of tunes I like, but um, this is lesson number three, Live Forever. Um, a G, D, A minor, C, E minor and an F major seven. So that was lesson number three. Lesson number four, we've done Stand By Me, that great Oasis tune. Um, lots of chords in this one. We've got a G, a B7, C, C stroke B, a D, a D sus four, an A minor, an A7, a G stroke F sharp, and an F major seven. So loads and loads of chords in there. And lesson number five, we've done a No Gallagher's High Flying Birds song. Um, if I had a gun, I love this tune. Um, play it on my guitar quite a bit. Um, so that was a G, um, E minor, A sus two, a C, A minor, and a D. So that was lesson number five. And lesson number six, which we're just about to do, is Broken Arrow by No Gallagher's High Flying Birds. Absolutely brilliant tune. But um, yeah, absolutely brilliant. So like I said, I'm going to do a series three um, for the um, Easy Beginners Baritone Ukulele. So watch out for that in a little while. Um, but we need to get uh, less um, series two out of the way first. So right, Broken Arrow by No Gallagher's High Flying Birds. I thought I'd try and mix up um, some Oasis and No Gallagher's High Flying Birds songs. Um, I think they turn out quite well, seeing that they're actually being played on a um, baritone ukulele. Uh, yeah, I think they, they sounded quite nice. So Broken Arrow, this is lesson number six now. So Broken Arrow, um, it's got six chords. We've got an E minor, a D major, a G major, a B7. I love that uh, B7 sound. A C major and an A major. So that's your six chords. 
I know we've done them before, lots and lots of times, I expect hundreds of times now, but um, hopefully you'll be getting them quite some um, quick changes now and, and things. So, right, so I'm gonna just show you the fingering of these chords. I know we've done them loads and loads of times. So, E minor, so, ah, oh, I didn't do it, did I? I didn't do the strings. I'm just gonna do the strings a minute. So, string number one, the one right down the bottom is string one E, string two B, string three G, and string four D. Well, that's it, the way. So now you know which strings uh, everything's on. So E minor is our first little chord. So I use my second finger for this chord, and it's second fret, fourth string. Play all the strings. That's your E minor. Your next chord is a D major. So um, D major, same as the guitar, same shape, same place. Um, so your first finger is in the second fret of the fifth string, your second finger is in the second fret of the first string, and your third finger is in the third fret of the second string. So that's your D major. Right, you've got a nice little easy G major now. So G major is just third fret, first string, one right in the bottom, you just play all the strings, that's your G major. Then we've got a nice B7 now sound in B7 that. So your first finger is in the first fret of the fourth string, your second finger is in the second fret of the third string, and your first finger is in the second fret of the first string. That's your B7. So now we've got a nice C major. So your C major, your first finger is in the first fret of the second string, and your second finger is in the second fret of the fourth string. That's your C major. So we've got a nice A major now. I know I've showed you an A major with a with a two fingered um, chord, um, but this is the actual A major, um, the same shape as the as the um, guitar. Um, right. So your first finger is in the first second fret. Of the first string, your second finger is in the second fret of the third string, and your third finger is in the second fret of the second string. I'll just go over it again now because I think I might have said that wrong actually. So this is A major. Your um, first finger is in the second fret of the fourth string, and your second finger is in the second fret of the third string, and your third finger is in the second fret of the second string. So. The bottom one is the only one that's opened. That's your A major. So that's a E minor, a D major, a G major, a B7, C major, and an A major. Right, so Broken Arrow by No Gallagher's High Flying Birds. So we've got a nice little strumming pattern. This is a, it's a down, down. Do it again, so it's a down, 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 up, down, up, down, up. Right, so we've got a nice little intro of a E minor, a D, a G, and a D. E minor, a D, a G, and a D. That's by two, so that's that little intro, and you go straight into verse one now. I'll just show you how I play the intro. Um, so, it, so it goes like this. So it starts in A minor, E minor. E minor, a D, a G, and a D. That's by two. So we do that again. So it's a E minor, a D, a G, and a D. E minor. That's the intro part, so we go straight into verse one now. So it's um, I'll just do it nice and slow. So it's falling angel, broken arrow. She comforts me and ease my troubled mind. Shine a light out into the shadows. one. 
So uh, we'll just get the chords for that a minute. So it's fall in E minor, angel D. The broken is a a G and a D. She comforts me. So she is a E minor. She comforts me is a D major. And E's is a G major. My troubled mind is a, a D major. Shine is a E minor. A light is a D major. Out. G major into. The shadow is a D major. All is a E ma uh, is a E minor. All the world D major. They make me leave is a a G major, and that lovely B seven on the end. Make me leave behind. Right, so we just do that again a minute. So it's um, I'll just play it again for you a minute. So it's. So that's uh, the verse is done. Uh, we'll just go through the whole song in a in a sec. So it's um, falling is a E minor, angel is a D major, the is a G major, broken arrow is a D major, she is a E minor, comforts me is a D major, and ease is a G major. My troubled mind is a D major, shine is a E minor, a light out, D major, into is a G major, the shadow is a D major, all is a E minor, the world they, D major, make me leave is a G major, behind is that lovely B7. So, um, that's the first one, and now there's like a little chorus now, so it's um Leave me in peace, I'm on the side of the angels If you die in a dream, let me live my life But the lies that they told me, makes me want to shiver My troubled mind. So that little part's a little bit faster, actually. So, so that that's not gonna ease my troubled mind. So that's an A major. Is um that is an A major. Is that's not gonna or go in. It's a D major to ease. Is a B seven. My troubled mind, E minor. So that's this little chorus part. So it's um, leave me in peace. I'm on the side of the angels. I die in a dream. And let me live my life. But the lies that they told me makes me wanna shiver. So we'll just go over the chords in a minute for that little chorus. So it's leave is a C, me in peace is a, a G, I'm on the side is a B7 of the angels is a A minor, if I die is a C major, in a dream is a, a G major, then let me live is that lovely B7. My life is an E minor, but the lies is a C major that they told me is a G major. They make is a B seven. 
We want to shiver as a an E minor. When I'm lost, it's a C major, and I'm lonely. That is a A major. Not going is a D major. To ease is a B7. My troubled mind is an E minor. So that's absolutely brilliant tune. So that's really the whole song. Um, but I'll I'll go through it a little bit more in a minute. So that was verse one and the chorus. So um. And after that little chorus, we've got, so after this part, um, That's not gonna ease my troubled mind. Now you've got like a little instrumental part now, so it's a, this is by four, so it's a E minor, a D, a G, and a D. So it's exactly the same chords as the intro. So it's a E minor, a D, a G, and a D. By four, E minor and D, G and a D, E minor and a D, a G and a D. So that's the that's the little instrumental just after the the little chorus part. Um, yeah, so that's by four. So that's E minor, D, G and D. That's by four. So then we go into like verse two. She's rolling over a misty morning. Set the sail forward, the four winds blow. She's a siren, I'm a warning. Give to say I never told you so. chords different on the end of that um, little verse there so she's rolling over so that's a E minor and a D a misty it's a G misty morning is a D set is a E minor set the sail is a D major for where the four winds is a G major blow She's it's an E minor. She's a siren, a D major, and I'm it's G major. I'm a warning. Uh, it's a D major. Um, so now it's um, this little last line where it's got um, an E minor and a a B seven on the end. Um, it just carries on a little bit there. So it's um. This is the last line of verse two, so it's um I'll just play it a minute. Here to say I never told you so Right, so that's um here to say so here is a E minor to say is a D major I never told is a G major you sew is a D major, so now you've got this um, little part without the singing, so it's a E minor, then it's a B7. I quite like that little ending on that uh, verse 2 there. So uh, I might just play verse 2 again, so it's um, She's rolling over a misty morning. Go into this little course again now, so it's Leave me in peace, I'm on the side of the angels I die in a dream So I think the words are a little bit different on this one Then let me live my life, I think it says um, Yes, it's exactly the same as the uh, verse, uh, as the chorus too actually So it's Leave me in peace, I'm on the side of the angels If I die in a dream, then let me live my life Lies that they told me, makes me want to shiver Lost in a lonely We've got this little 
fast part again now, so it's um That's not gonna ease my troubled mind. Then we've got that little um ending part again, so it's a E minor and a B7. So then we got some ooze now, so we got um a C, a C and a, a G and a D and an A E minor by four. But then we're doing we're sort of like doing some ooze, so it's um so you do that by four, um, so it's a C, G, D and E minor, um, so it's a little bit different round this time. So that's that little part, little instrumental part with those few little oohs, so it's like... Um, each chord you go that sort of thing and then we got some um, this last little part is leave me in peace I'm alone with my angel with different words on this one she died in a dream so I could live my life the lies that they told me Makes me wanna shiver. I'm lost and I'm lonely. That's not gonna ease my troubled mind. And uh, on the very last part, we got that. That's not gonna ease my troubled mind. So you've got a, a C now. C, a G, a D. A minor, so it's exactly the same as that little um, instrumental part we just done. That's by two, so it's a C, a G, a D, and an E minor. And now you've got this part again where it's that's not gonna ease my troubled mind. And this little outro now we've got a C, an A, a D. B7 and a E minor and that's the whole song so hopefully you've got where all the chords go um, I might just do a verse and a chorus so you've got the um, the chords again so um, yeah so that little outro um, that's not gonna ease my troubled mind so you do that then you do this little int instrumental a C a G a D E minor by two, then you got this. That's not gonna ease my troubled mind. Then we got a C, A, a D, B7, and an E minor. Absolutely brilliant tune. So it's um, falling angels. My troubled mind shine a light out into the shadow. All the world they make me leave behind. Leave me in peace. I'm on the side of the angels. If I die in a dream, then let me live my life. Ease my troubled mind. That little end part is a little bit faster. So um, we'll just get the chords again. So it's fall in is a E minor, angel is a D major, the is a G major, broken arrow is a D major, she is a E minor, comforts me, D major, and ease is a G major, my troubled mind is a D major. Shine is an E minor, a light out is a D major, into is a G major, the shadow is a D major, all is a E minor, the world is a D major, they make me leave is a G major, 
behind is that lovely B7. So there you have it. Broken Arrow by No Gallagher's High Flying Bird. So that's the end of this little series. So um, like I said at, at the beginning of this video, um, I'm going to do a series three. Um, I went on a camping holiday, which I said, and took my baritone ukulele and some music and I got six more songs sorted out. So uh, I just need to record them now. And um, Bob Durante. Right, so thanks for taking a look at um, this lesson six of series two of the Easy Beginners Baritone Ukulele. And um, I hope that you liked all the Oasis songs that we've done and Noel Gallagher's High Flying Bird songs. Never know, I might uh, do another little um, series like this with um, Oasis stuff, but uh, wait and see one day. So like I said, there's series three is on its way. We'll get uh, series two out the way first. And um, yeah, I look forward to seeing you in the next series, series three. So thanks for taking a look. And oh, I haven't rabbited on too much. And uh, But uh, yeah, Broken Owl is a brilliant tune. And I hope you liked it and I'll catch you again. Cheers now. Bye.